This isn't exactly starting off as our normal type of vlog. It's already 2.30 in the afternoon and I went to church this morning we came home and Calvin fell asleep on me and I was working on videos and blah blah blah. I haven't really picked up the camera today though because I just feel lousy. I don't know why. I was literally like on the verge of tears in church today for whatever reason. I don't know why. I just, I don't know. Feeling down today, I guess. There isn't really an explanation for it and I don't really know why. Sorry that this is starting off as a sad, boring vlog. That's kind of just where I'm at and why we didn't start today off this morning. Travis has been kind of working on projects. He's making a new base to our dining room table and I asked him to make a floating shelf for Calvin's room and all the while I'm just kind of blah. I just kind of feel lost today and without a purpose today. All around bad, lousy, alone, unworthy, useless, disappointing, ugly, unintelligent. You see where I'm going with this. I just, I don't know. For what reason, I have no idea. And I didn't even wake up this way. I kind of woke up in a fairly okay mood. Calvin was kind of whiny, but I mean, that's pretty normal. I don't know. I went to church by myself and then just sat there feeling awful. So that's kind of where I'm at. But hopefully we can turn this day around and have a better day and go and make some stuff and do some stuff and not feel this bad about myself. I have been working in Calvin's room, not that you can tell, and got some things rearranged a little bit. I'm currently washing his bedding and I cleaned out his entire closet like I was supposed to do the other day and set this all up because this is going to be closed, so I'm trying to get used to, you know, having that the way it's supposed to be. Travis is working on a shelf right here for Calvin. I asked if he could make me a floating shelf. So he's working on that, and while it's drying, because he painted it, he's working on more of his, uh, well not really working on it, just experimenting with his wood burning stuff. The first one he did well, turned out really cool, so he's doing it again, because why not? There's my dog. You're a woozer. Frog legs and all. He looks fat. He looks like a stuffed turkey. It's a huge stuffed turkey. sure exactly what the exact measurements of what are with that but Calvin's shelf is done and it's pink. It almost just sits there. Don't touch it. It'll fall. It's just wedged there at the moment. Dinner or Dunkin Donuts? It's right now? Yes, which do you want first? Let me holster this. Dinner or Dunkin' Donuts? 
Who remembers this road? Show of hands? Anyone? Probably not because this road never had a fence on it. But this is the road that's right behind the dog park that everyone would throw trash out on. I've, we've been down here a couple times. I've shown this road a couple times. But it's never had this fence the whole way. Right here it has, I think. Yeah, this fence was here. But the other fence was never here and it was always lined with trash the entire way. So there. I don't know what they're planning to do, but they're clearing all this out. Like this was always all I mean, you can see all the garbage up there. Look at it all. It's crazy. What are they doing? Dang, they're just clearing away. It's like a jungle. Look at it. Now that we've turned around and are heading back, this was the road I was talking about. And the cows. There's cows up here. This, we actually stopped right here, right? Because there was a fridge and we were going to take the metal off of it. Give us your best moo, Calvin. That was a good one. There was always so much trash here. What's happening? And right, right past this little guardrail, there was tires down here, right? Like right here? One of these spots, there was a bunch of tires. Yeah, and now it's all gone. This is weird. We were out driving around a little bit after we went and got our coffees, driving through Chibana to see if there was any anything being thrown out. And Calvin spotted a park and wanted to come and play. So we stopped so he can come and play. And, and there was this like thing you could like straddle your arms on. Straddle your arms on, yeah. I don't know what a straddle means. I'll show you. I can do that. Can you? Yeah. You're doing it. Yeah. Keep going. Why are you doing that? Did it! Good job. Nice. Get your shoes. It's already about quarter after eight now. I'm working on some dinner, as you can hear, and Travis is putting up Calvin's shelf in his room, trying to get it, you know, level and to put it into studs so it doesn't just rip out of the wall, that sort of thing. I'm making us some stuffed peppers, though. That's what's sizzling away is the ground beef. I'm gonna cut up some mushrooms and put it in there as well, and instead of like the normal tomato-y based sauce that I mix in with it, I'm gonna try something a little different. I just don't know exactly what that is yet. All clean. It's the into my ear. Which one? This one? It's on the top level, the little one. Right here? Mm -hmm. Is that better? Yep. Calvin, did you see your bookshelf? Yeah. Come look at it. It has all your books on it. Daddy is so awesome. But what about another book on this end? Well, I don't want to get them too close because I don't want them to fall off because then that would defeat the purpose of having this cut if you're still just hitting them. And then all your little books can go on this side. Isn't that so perfect? Can you read the one about dinosaurs rescue the town? Dinosaur rescue? Do you want to take it and then after I'm done making your bed? Sure, bite it. All right, I'm going to make your bed really quick, okay? I need to put your sheets back on. Thank you, handsome. I love it. And then you just walk in like, oh, hey, what's up? I'm a bookshelf. No one's going to say that but me. Calvin's room is completely done now. I just got his bed put back together. His bookshelf is done. His room is pretty much clean for now. And dinner is done. So we're gonna go and eat post-dinner activities. I would just like to take a second to apologize for my sad sack, sappy, whiny. Sometimes I just feel crappy. Being home all day long, most of the time like by myself, yeah, I have Calvin, 
but I have no adult interaction at all. It gets kind of lonely, especially days when Travis works and comes home, eats dinner, and goes right to sleep. I'm like, well, dang it, because I look forward to him coming home so I have someone to talk to. That was why I had mentioned the other day that if you want to write us, write us. If you want to comment something, something super simple or two words or a whole freaking story. Like, I don't care what it is. I love talking to you guys. I love having someone to talk to. I get so bored and so lonely sometimes that you guys and God get me through because I just get so down sometimes. But I just wanted to say thank you and that I love you guys so much and thank you for watching and being with us and being our family and caring about us and wanting to see good things happen with our family. You want to see us go places and you want to travel with us and I think that is so awesome. So just thank you guys so much. But it's 1045 and as you saw, Calvin's passed out on the couch. And so is Travis. So I'm gonna go get those two and we're gonna head to bed. But if you liked today's video for whatever reason, please, 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 please give it a thumbs up for me. And hit subscribe down below if you haven't already, which I assume if you're here, you definitely subscribe. But if by chance you're not, hit the subscribe button and you can follow along with us every day, pretty much. I say we'll see you when we see you, but let's face it, we all know it's gonna be tomorrow. For now, that is that, and we will see you when we see you. Bye. One's already on his second wife. One's just barely getting by, but these people raised me.